multiple strikes came a few hours before Russian President Vladimir Putin was due to hold a meeting with his Security Council, as Moscow's war in Ukraine approaches its eight-month milestone and the Kremlin reels from humiliating battlefield setbacks in areas it is trying to annex amid a Ukrainian counteroffensive in recent weeks. A day earlier, Putin had called the attack on the Kerch Bridge to Crimea a terrorist act carried out by Ukrainian special services. In a meeting Sunday with the chairman of Russia's investigative committee Putin said there's no doubt it was a terrorist act directed at the destruction of critically important civilian infrastructure. Russia's military hurled a barrage of missiles against Ukrainian cities, including the capital Kiev, early Monday, striking civilian targets in what could be Moscow's retaliation for the bombing of a key bridge connecting Russia to its annexed territory of Crimea. The first strikes on Kiev in four months targeted the center of the city and left dead and wounded an emergency service spokesperson told the AP. Blasts were reported in the city's Shevchenko district, a large area in the center of Kiev that includes the historic old town as well as several government offices, Mayor Vitaly Klitschko said. Lesia Vasilenko, a member of Ukraine's parliament, posted a photo on Twitter showing that at least one explosion occurred near the main building of the Kiev National University in central Kiev. After the first early morning strikes in Kiev, more loud explosions were heard later in the morning in an intensification of Russia's attack that could spell a major escalation in the war. Meanwhile, Associated Press journalists in the center of Dnipro city saw the bodies of multiple people killed at an industrial site on the city's outskirts. Windows in the area had been blown out and glass littered the street. Rescue workers surveyed the scene of a Russian attack on Kiev. Ukraine on Monday, October 10, 2022. Rescue workers survey the scene of a Russian attack on Kiev, Ukraine on Monday, October 10, 2022. Two explosions rocked Kiev early Monday following months of relative calm in the Ukrainian capital AP photo Adam Sprek. Ukrainian media also reported explosions in a number of other locations, including the western city of Elbiv that has been a refuge for many people fleeing the fighting in the east as well as Kharkiv Chernopyl, Kaj Melnitsky, Jatomir, and Kropivitsky. In Elbiv, energy infrastructure was hit, regional governor Maxim Kozaitsky said. The explosions were heard by AP journalists and appeared to be the result of missile strikes. The multiple strikes came a few hours before Russian President Vladimir Putin was due to hold a meeting with his Security Council as Moscow's war in Ukraine approaches its eight-month milestone and the Kremlin reels from humiliating battlefield setbacks in areas it is trying to annex amid a Ukrainian counteroffensive in recent weeks. A day earlier, Putin had called the attack on the Kerch Bridge to Crimea a terrorist act carried out by Ukrainian special services. In a meeting Sunday with the chairman of Russia's investigative committee Putin said there's no doubt it was a terrorist act directed at the destruction